Hey, what's going on guys? Zone Operator here. Uh, today we're going to be starting a long overdue beginning of a playthrough of the original trilogy, starting with Stalker Shadow of Chernobyl. Um, yeah, this is unmodded, nothing, no mods, no nothing, just bare bones, OG, vanilla, Stalker. Playing in the order of release, not in the chronological order, so we'll be playing Shadow of Chernobyl, Clear Sky, Call of Pripyat. Let's uh let's not waste any time. Let's get into it. We're gonna be playing on master difficulty. Let's do it. seems to be alive. What a lucky guy. At least death would have saved him from the dreams. Let's go and see what value Sidorovich will put on your head. What have you got? A body. It came from the death truck. It's got the mark. Well, you know the drill. Leave him on this the... This is a live one. Bullshit. You are lying. Let the zone take me if I am. Put it here. I think for this one, I can give you. Oh, man. So, Marked One, I saved you, and I'm not going to pretend I did it to win favors upstairs. You do some jobs for me, and we're even. Besides, keeping you busy might be a good way to deal with your amnesia. And I'll see what I can find out about your problem. I don't give a shit why you want to find this Strelik guy. I mind my own business. If you want to kill him, well... You must have your... What are you standing there for? Come closer. Yeah, cut himself off mid-speech. Classic stalker jank. Oh, man. It's so good to be back in the original. I was trying not to talk during the cutscene to leave it unspoiled. I had to, I had to try so hard not to laugh when uh, Sid says, Bullshit! You're lying! Oh, my God. Makes me chuckle every time. God damn, look how good this game looked, even for back in, when was this released, like 2010, something like that, 2011? I don't even remember. Anyway, let's uh, let's talk this to Sid here. This is yours. Either I brainwash you like I usually do with all the rookies, or I treat you like a real stalker, and I give you a mission straight away. 
Um, just give me mission. The tutorial is just like he explains by PDA and shit like that. Got a job for you, Mark One. I want you to find a stalker called Nimble. He was carrying some very important information. He disappeared somewhere near the bridge. Find him. Dead or alive, I don't care. I need the flash drive with the info. Visit Wolf from the local camp and ask him. He certainly knows where that guy can be. Got it. Good old Marked One, classic. Who is the Marked One? We just don't know. That's all for now. Bring me the flash drive and we'll consider the fact that you've partially paid me for saving you. Got it. Free leather jacket. Right off the pop. Uh, well, good hunting, stalker. Oh, whoops. No, hang on. Right. I'm wearing a leather jacket. Good hunting, stalker. Alright, so we've got nothing. we got binoculars, and that's it. And our... Yeah, trusty bolts. Look at these environments. Obviously, things like Anomaly and OGSE and Misery and all that stuff. You know, updated a lot of this stuff, but yeah, it still looks good. I don't believe I have a knife yet either. No, no knife yet. Uh, oh yeah. Man, I gotta change my controls. I want shift to be shift, not X. Swap those around. Okay, we got the leaning. Shift works. Crouch, low crouch. All right, it's all good. Oh, Wolf, you're standing here. Usually you're standing over there. Hi, why are you here? I need to see Nimble. You know where I can find him? Nimble got a raw deal. This group was attacked by some bandits a little ways from here. All he could do was send me an SOS message. I looked like... It, it looked like his pals went under. My guys told me these bastards are now at the old car park, the one across the road. You don't rescue your own people from prison? Not what I would call friendly, or is it just too we- Or is it you're just too weak to do it? I'd bop you one, but what's the use? It's not that simple. I got too few people, and even those I got are mostly rookies. I can't take the risk. If we lose this camp, things are even worse for all stalkers out there. What about yourself? If you aren't too scared, I won't let pride take me. Yep, I think I can do it alone. Now you stand no chance on your own. My scouts are good soldiers, and right now, they're right behind those freaks. Together, you can make a run for it. What do you think? You got the guts. I'll try. Guys, I'm sending someone your way, so wing it. You may attack if necessary. Over. All right, Wolf, send him in. As long as he stays out of the way. Out. Okay, now we got a pistol. Now, and our knife. Alright, great. Some stalkers won't talk to you if you stick your weapons in their face. Hide your weapon or select the bolt. Alright, we got the... We got the PM. Right, it's called the PM or the PMM or whatever it's called. Yeah, PMM. Probably one of the worst weapons in the zone, but... Hey. We got the knife, which is God's... God's weapon. Alright. Let's do this. Let's head over to the car park. Kill the bandits. Rescue our boy. The thing is, you can't run while moving diagonally. So you can run, but if you try to move diagonally, you stop sprinting. So it's just... Aim and, aim and sprint. Okay, these are our boys. Pipe down, man. Let me fill you in. Hello, Wolf was already sent word of you. You got any questions? How many bandits? Uh, seven or eight people, two by the gate, two more in the building to the right near the fire, and another two in the one to the left. That's where they're keeping nimble. Somebody usually hangs around the yard as well. That's about it. Shall we say a prayer and go? 
Let's go. Men, Wolf here sent us some support along with the order to attack. Time to move on and be heroes. All right, let's do it. F5 is my quick save, right? Just double check that. F6. Get it. Just change that real quick. The screen's gonna black out when I change it. Begin voting. Okay, quick save works. Let's do it. Bust a cap and some bandits. With the PM. Oh yeah. Ow. I think the first time I ever played this game, I ran out of bullets and I was like looting bandits to try and get guns. Why did I just put my gun away? Oh, did I just give him my stuff? Look, such a dummy. Oh, this guy was, this guy was pushing me out of cover. The shotgun guy in here. Yeah, the AI isn't the smartest. They're a little, uh, they're a little bit sometimes. Alright, got a shotgun, got a grenade, uh, and the shotgun's already equipped. You can do a lot of aiming just with the, uh, the regular crosshairs. Shotgun blast was loud as hell. Oh, we lost a guy. Rip. Nice med kits. We want that. Take the guns and stuff. Just because you can sell them later on. Not for a lot, but, you know, it's something. And jellyfish artifact right off the hop. That's kind of swag. Last guy's inside. Yep. Yeah, I'll be there in a second, number. Factory cleared. Returning to starting positions. Out. I'm coming, nimble, my bimble, bimble. Anybody alive? Hey, buddy. I owe you, brother. I could never thank you enough. Thanks, brother. You did us a great service. I don't even know how to thank you. Listen, I need that flash drive you're, you were taking to the trader. You have it? Yeah, I got it. Those morons can't even do a proper search. Wait, what the heck? Oh, well, what the heck? Take it. After all, you saved my life. It was well hidden, but these thugs can't frisk for shit. Thanks. Where did you keep it anyways? Who knows? Might come in handy. I didn't keep it down there, so don't worry. I worked for trader. <laughs> I've worked for trader for long and for a long time so I can store information safely. By the way, I told the thugs a nice little story about the cache full of artifacts and they ordered one guy to go there. The cache exists, but it's only got one artifact. I can give you its coordinates if you want. Sure. Don't forget, there's lots of wild animals there. Besides, the gangster they sent is armed with more than a scoop and a shovel, so be careful. Thanks, man. Thanks to you, too. Okay. Nimble, secure. 
Job accomplished. Uh, yeah, P is for my PDA. All right, we got a, st a stash nearby. We can uh, run back to Sid. Uh, check these crates. A little bit of vodka. Nibble's taking a nap. in their chest. Nothing pick up over there. Always check the crates. You may have heard a dog whimpering for a second there. Kind of strange because the stalker ambient tracks will play the sound of a of like a, a mutant or something. I wonder if there should be one there. I think there is one here now, though. Yeah, there is. Er. Damn douche. Uh, you guys got anything you want to say? Nope, nothing. Okay. Alright, uh, let's, um... First guitar track we gotta listen to this. Excellent. Beautiful. I love it. I love it. Alright, so I say we, uh... Yeah, I say we go hit the stash and, uh... We go hit this stash, then we run back to Sid and, uh, check in with him. Well, while I'm thinking of it. that hip 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 now mutants in the early game are freaking deadly so we're gonna try and not get absolutely dunked on by them well the boars are fighting the dogs it's a dead guy over there if you want to you can always try and use anomalies defensively like There's a dead body in this barn. Hang on a sec. So the mini map lets me know. Dead bandito. Rip. R.I.P. El Bandito. Also, when you can, use level geometry to your advantage. Hop up on a box or a rock or something like that, and a lot of the time, mutants will have trouble closing the distance. Stuff like that. Stuff like that will keep you alive. The 
This directional audio is throwing me off. That was just a bad shot on my part. See if I can run up and check this guy. Okay, check them. Oh, yeah, are these just flesh. Oh no, these are boars. I thought they were just fleshes. Okay. Um. So the stash is like right ahead. I just don't want to get ganked by these mutants. Uh, I can't shoot. Whoa. That was a good box. Military choppers already. Oh. Wow. Guy's dead too. And this guy. I'm pretty sure he's supposed to be able to save these guys, but I think they got ganked by the mutants. Very sad. Okay. How can I get to the stash without getting absolutely dumpstered by some boars? Come on. Run at me into the thing. think so. He tried, but I was too smart for him. It's to my left. Ah, the tree. You want some dog? I'll give it to you, but don't fuck with me. I'm a man with a sawed-off shotgun. I know what I'm doing. I think it's this tree. Nope, it's not that tree either. And is it, don't they have the tree stump things uh, in this one? Is a backpack in the bush? Oh, it's right here. Found it! Another silenced pistol. Alright, not a bad opener. That is something you can unload the weapons you pick up, so just do that. An easy way to get an extra couple bullets. Alright, let's get back to Sid. Turn in the day's work. Oh, thought I could do it. But I couldn't. You got the loot? I got the loot. Greetings, Mark One. Did you manage? The situation has become clear. Clear sky. Where's the flash drive? Here it is. Okay, give me a stash and some little bit of quiche. Any special Wait, missions? Mark One. I've done some thinking, and here's what I'd like to offer. Generally speaking, what you really need is to find Strelok, right? 
Let's assume I do. Anyway, here's the thing about Strelok. There's a stalker that goes by this name. They say he's found a path to the northern reaches of the zone. That is a virgin area, a real gold mine for artifacts. Yeah. Anyway, I can help you find him. However, as you can imagine, it won't be a free ride. You'll have to work it off. But in the long run, we'll both benefit. You're going to waste that Strelik fella and find out what happened to you, and I'll find... Uh, well, I mean, I'll get my share of our mutual profit. <laughs> so what do you say? Deal. Go on. All right, listen. You mean business, I can see that. And I... I mean, we need guys like you. We're doing sort of an investigation with some other traders. We want to open up a path to the north, to the center of the zone. And near the center, something or someone is trying to hamper our progress. How the heck this Strelok managed to sneak through, I don't know. You see, there's this one area where your brain starts boiling. An eerie place. Anyway, to cut a long story short, a couple of guys have been spying on those grunts for me, not far from here. Apparently the ones at the Agroprom Research Institute have dug up something, something major. I'm positive it has something to do with the center of the zone. Anyway, whatever they've dug up, it's secured somewhere in the third floor of the Institute. We really need this stuff. You know what I mean? I think so. Once you have the briefcase, don't bring it here. Take it straight to the barman. He runs the stalker bar at 100 rads. I'll upload the coordinates and all the data you need to your PDA. Clear? Gotcha. You'll need to go north through the garbage, then turn west. You'll end up at the Agroprom Research Institute after a few kilometers. And be careful, the radiation level is way too high at the garbage. So I suggest you invest in some anti-rad. Or some vodka. Well, good luck. Alright. Anything else? Okay. Any jobs? Tale of a pseudo dog. Kill the sales representative. Purchase the area of mutants. Find a jellyfish. I think I already have a jellyfish. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, jellyfish. Done. Any other jobs? Kill the sales representative, sure. Okay, we can take it all. Let's take all the jobs. Alright. Oh, hang on, I gotta trade some of the stuff on me. What is this shit? Hang on. Am I carrying the best shotgun? This one's better. My pistol's the best. Alright, now we trade. Boom. What is this? Oh yeah, right. You can accidentally trade the stuff you're carrying. Oh yeah, I forgot. Okay, just get rid of this stuff. Six hundred bucks, give or take. Not bad. All right. I always forget you can you can trade the stuff you're carrying. Accident. Just something well, I, I gotta remember. Good hunting, stalker. Thanks, Sid. See you around. Meet the journeyman. Okay, we'll, we'll meet the journeyman in a sec. Okay, some free stuff down here. Free stuff there. Uh, the stash is in the rafters of the house, I think. Yeah, it's up here. I can hear the uh, 
Shit. You can hear the military officer on the PDA. Classic. Um, is the stash up here? God, I can't remember the stashes of the OGs. Not the zone from you. Oh, I walked on top of it. Three med kits? That's huge. Alright, let's go talk to the journeyman. Got anything, but... Just do this random lore stuff. This is just huge lore dumps. Just read these if you want. Feel free to pause the video if you want to read this stuff. Hunting stalker. All right. Well, I don't know what that means with the journeyman shit is, but they want me to bring some foreign tourist over. He paid some dough to my homies to get a look at the zone. Oh, I gotta escort a tourist. Where is he? Nice, another first aid kit. Smash the boxes, people. Seriously. It's not you, is it? No. You? It's not you. It's not you. Is it Wolf that has to hook me up? Your guys and I made it A-OK -okay at the car park. It's awesome, man. Here, take this. Free jellyfish. Destroy the boar layer? Sure. I'm up for it. So where's this dude I gotta transport? Bring the customer what's promised. Oh, I gotta go here. I thought I was looking at the, the rookie camp by looking at this. I'm such a dummy. I'm so silly. There's another stash over here. We'll do some missions uh, next time. For now, I think that's uh, a pretty good intro to the Stocko Shadow of Chernobyl, uh, you know, playthrough, episode one. I feel like I'm a lot shorter than everybody else here. I don't know. Maybe I'm crazy. But, uh, yeah, part one, Shadow of Chernobyl playthrough in the books. Um... Stay tuned, I'll be doing a full playthrough of all three of the games. It's just part one of the first game to be released. And uh, yeah, we'll continue more in the next part. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in part two.